They have penguins. They have penguins. 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 <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> the wonders of life. Well, uh, I'm sorry, wonders of wildlife aquarium. This place is going to be awesome. So I think they said this was voted like the best aquarium in the U.S. We are going to find out. We're going to give that a give that a test. I don't know we? if they allow video cameras, but we're going to find out, and we're just going to go in and we're just going to have fun. Penguins. Penguins. And sharks. And there's a touch tank for uh, stingrays. Let's do it. Well, manta rays maybe. I don't know. Stingrays. Yeah. Yeah, this is really cool how they how they made it look like an ocean. And you got the big tuna that they're fishing for. That is beautiful the way that they made this. That is beautiful. Thank you, dolphin. Oh, there's a dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> This is the Fishing Hall of Fame in here. There's a lot of really cool things to see in this building. Sailfish. Look, these are all the presidents. This hall here is really all devoted to the presidents of the United States. There's a lot of pictures of the presidents on fishing trips. Look at that. <laughs> Franklin Roosevelt in his black sea bass. It's really interesting. And I think this is so cool to see the Bass Force One right here. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. awesome. The Carters and their fishing, fishing tackle boxes. And look, you can see our fishing right there. Fly fishing is so great. We have entered the shipwreck room. There's a lot of really cool aquariums that we get to see here. Yeah. This is incredible. This is where the, the snack bar is. I, I can smell the popcorn. Uh, yeah, it I can smell really the food here. <laughs> oh, this is great. The lobsters. 
So this one, they've got some plaques here so you can actually see what fish is in the aquariums. There's an eel in here. There's two. I have actually seen two eels close up in my life. Have you? One hit me in the face mask while okay. I was snorkeling. <laughs> oh look, garden eels. I've seen those too. Scuba diving, look how cool they are. Oh, the ones that look like little yeah, plants growing? And, and when you get near them, they, they usually sink in, but oh, okay. then if you wait, then they come back out. How there's cool There's a bunch that? of them in there. There's a lot like, of them. Like there's another eel in that little opening. Can you see his mouth? Yep, and that pipe <laughs> over there. I love how they make this look like you're, uh, you know, under a, a structure. This is like if you're at a ship, you can see where it's busted through the hole right there. <laughs> oh, it's a little shark, Some lionfish. These are beautiful and they're jerks. They're beautiful fish, but they're an invasive species yes, in the Gulf. Yes, they're jerks to the reef. This is really a great room because it's hard to see here, but up here in the ceiling, they made it look like you're under the water. Fantastic way to uh, make an aquarium. Yes. Now we're entering the swamp at night, it says. Oh, you really can't see much in here, it's too dark. Abby's waiting to find the otter. I don't see any. We don't see it though, it's all hiding somewhere. This place just keeps delivering. You go through another door and into another section. red drum right there. It's a really, really popular game fish along the Gulf Coast. Look at them all up inside that, whatever that plant life is. Looks like a touch tank. Are you going to okay. go for it? Of course I'm going to go for it. <laughs> we can touch these? So just don't touch the middles where their mouths are. Okay. And the easiest way is to lay your hand in the middle here, or in the round, the edge and they'll suck <gasps> up next to you. Oh, oh wow. they sure will. <laughs> wow. What are these called? Sea anemones. Okay. That's incredible. You gotta do it. Oh, you want me to do it? Okay. Of course I want you to do it. <laughs> okay.
<laughs> That's so cool. They just, oh yeah, they just attach right to you. And you just pull away. That's, That's cool. really cool. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cool. Wow. Any, anywhere on those? Yeah, just on the tops of the bags, yeah. Wow. Hey, buddy. They're rough. So pretty. Is this something different? It's a sea anemone, just a different breed. A different breed. This looks like a uh, one of those shark cages there. You want to do it? Sure. <laughs> I'll do it. Oh. Yep. Look how cute. What'd you find? A little frog. Some frogs. How cute is that? That is cool. This is the the Amazon area. Red piranha. This is the subject of uh, many horror films right here. <laughs> oh, cool. See, they've got the, uh, oh, yeah, the, the fish the in fish there in that there. they're feeding them. Amazing. Lunker Lake. You know what's going to be in this one, don't you? What? You know what's going to be in this one, don't you? Bass. Largemouth bass. Yes. And there are a bunch of them in there. Big boys. And down there. This one looks like me. The tongue. <laughs> <laughs> striped bass right there. That's a biggie. And that big catfish. <laughs> There's some more of the freshwater fish that I'm used to growing up fishing with dad and granddad. You have the black crappie, crappie. There's bluegill in there, brim. I believe the red air sunfish. These are the color of my shoestrings. Are they? <laughs> yeah, they're beautiful. <laughs> Shells of the sea. You got some uh, seahorses right here. 
Seahorse is the only species that I know of that I remember learning that the male is the one that um, it holds the eggs. Yep. Giant Pacific octopus. That is incredible. These look like they're always ready to fight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> River monsters. River monsters. <laughs> look at the eyes on that. <laughs> This is great. <laughs> is that the otter? It's a bee. Oh, it's a beaver. Look, Look at that guy. He's so cute. Hey. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Some of these tanks always look so clear on the yeah. camera here, and others are so dark. Abby has made it to the Stingray oh. Touch tank right here. Okay. That one didn't want to be touched. I'm gonna see if I can get a better shot on this side. It's really dark. They're motoring. They are just flying around that tank, aren't oh. they? <laughs> He's like, pet me. Oh, Ooh. look, it's it's waiting, look. Aw. <laughs> kind of scared me when it came up because it just ran into my hand. <laughs> he wants you to touch him. Wow, that's huge. Oh, that's huge. a big one right there. Look how big that guy is. Wow. <laughs> Likes that, huh? Yeah. <laughs> So we have been all the way through the aquarium now, which was awesome. There was so much cool stuff there to see. I, I didn't get half on video what is actually there for you to it's enjoy. It's incredible. It is. So we're, we just walked through the Bass Pro Shop. That's where we're at right now. And we are headed to the penguins. Penguins. We're going to go see some penguins. I'm ready. Abby is ready. So <laughs> we are headed there. Wow. Everything here is so beautifully done. Isn't yeah. It? That is. Incredible. Yep. Huge. Okay, so I was gonna say on camera that I totally love buffalo, but honestly, I kind of love everything that's not a snake. <laughs> yes, she does. So, <laughs> it's like every five minutes I'm like, oh my God, this is my favorite. Oh my God, this is my favorite. No, buffalo are awesome. Look at all the buffalo. All right, we're still trying to find the penguins. <laughs> There's a lot to see here. Yes. I mean, we just walked through a, a huge uh, museum area just back there. We didn't even really uh, look at it very much. That's we're because just... I am dying to see penguins. Yeah, <laughs> we're, we are ready to see some penguins and we've been here a couple hours already. So yes, we're ready to get moving. Oh, wow. It's a big bear. They have a, uh, a really amazing Native American exhibit here. I think we finally made it to the penguins. <laughs> so cute. I've seen these once before and it's awesome to watch them swim because they just dive in and swim so fast. Maybe we'll get to see them do it. <laughs> yes. By six feet of distance between parties, we thank you for your patience and understanding as we implement these measures to keep everyone safe. Oh, one finally jumped in. <laughs> <laughs> yes.
Yes. The um, the plaque said that they can swim up to 22 miles an hour. They Incredible. Are the, they are the fastest swimming bird. They, they're so cute that they almost look fake. Like, I know. You don't even well, like... when we came in here, they look like little <laughs> like, statues. Like these? Yeah. Exactly. And they started moving. We're really, we've really been amazed at just how much they have here in this museum to show because we didn't expect all this to be here. I no. mean, we've been walking for another hour uh, through all of the cool. animal exhibits. And it is really cool. Everywhere we go, it, it's just amazing to see what they have uh, built in here for people to enjoy. There really is a lot here to see and learn from. They do a good job of uh, explaining things. There is so much, uh, like, the Native American artifacts in there that we just passed through. They're so beautiful. There really is a lot in here. That art gallery, the Lewis and Clark Art Gallery was... Yes, Lewis and Clark Art Gallery. That was amazing. And giraffes. <laughs> That's a lot bigger than the one I wanted to get. <laughs> <laughs> that was wonderful. It I really loved was. it so much. It was beautifully, beautifully done. There's so much more here than just the aquarium, which I did not realize that. You have lots of exhibits in there, lots of museums, and that's why they call it the wonders of life, because it really covers not only the aquatic life in the aquarium, but the uh, land bearing life too of all animals from many different continents not just the u.s but it was really informative oh. and amazing i mean and we were we rushed through quite a bit of it and we've been here for over two hours you could be here all day long yeah you could really take you a, really could a, an entire day here um, because there's a lot of stuff that you can read and learn yes. from as well but that's that's why they have different passes available too yes. so that you can come back another day you know, and extend your uh, visit here and continue to see and read and learn uh, everything that they have here. So it really is, truly, it's an amazing place. Yes. I, we have thoroughly enjoyed our visit. Yes, it surprised me how great it was. I, I thought that the exhibit where they showed, you know, the boat with the... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to remember which one it was I that you were talking so about. Many things. With the game fish. You know, oh, with yeah. the, I thought that was one of the coolest things I've ever seen because that's not something that you normally see at aquariums. No, it's you not. Know? I mean, and, and it was very, you know what, every single exhibit that we have seen, we, we were amazed at the quality, the high quality yes. and how they constructed it. Every yes. single detail, because everywhere you look, you're seeing things that you didn't see until you looked over here and you see another Correct. little animal over here, you know. It's very Disney-esque. They, spare, they spared yeah. no expense for every little corner in there and we loved the lighting and... Yeah. The animals, I mean, the I sounds, just loved it. The sounds of it is amazing. It truly is a wonderful place. So it's not it's not something that you can truly capture on video. No. It's something that you have to come, have to come. and experience for yourself. Yes. So if but you're coming come, through Spring, Springfield, check yeah, this place yes, out. Yes, yes. I'm glad that we did it because we, can, we did consider not coming. And I told Abby, I said, I think you're going to miss out if you don't go see that aquarium. Yeah. And we got to see so much more than just an aquarium. Well, I think for a second, without researching, you think, oh, it's a Bass Pro Shop. So I've seen the tanks, right. which, which are awesome, but, you know, not like that. Yeah, this is so much more. Yes. So much more than just a single little aquarium inside of a Bass Pro. Yes. This is a museum. This is what yes. this is. I cannot speak highly enough of it. No but, wonder it's the number one aquarium in the U.S. The exhibit halls for the Native American stuff is uh, amazing. And there was even an exhibit hall for uh, Eskimos. Yes. They were showing the way the Eskimos developed their clothing. Like, what was the one that used animal it was a intestinal seal, linings? Yep, for like a parka. Yeah, that was yep. truly amazing. Yep, they used everything that they had. Yep. Incredible. So we're going to wrap up our visit here. And we've got some more things that we're going to go enjoy today. But I think the camera is through with today. But we're going to go see a couple more places here in Springfield and enjoy the rest of our day here. That was awesome. Thanks for taking me, babe. Hopefully you guys enjoyed <laughs> this video and our little adventure here. Come visit this place. Yep.